Russian President Vladimir Putin criticized the monopoly in global financial payment systems and called for an independent and blockchain-based settlement network on November 24th, speaking at the International Artificial Intelligence Journey Conference in Moscow. Putin also noted that global payments and nations are at risk due to tense relations between Russia and the West following Ukraine's invasion, labeling sanctions imposed by countries as illegitimate restrictions. The existing system of international payment is expensive. The system of its correspondent accounts and regulation are controlled by a narrow club of states and financial groups, noted the Russian president. Binance CEO Chan Peng Zhao has stated that countries should regulate crypto rather than fight it, claiming that crypto adoption will occur regardless. CZ stated at a Binance event in Athens, Greece on 25th November that crypto regulation has once again become a hot topic considering the recent fallout of cryptocurrency exchange FTX. He advised countries to propose regulations rather than oppose the crypto sector. I think most governments now understand that adoption will happen regardless. It is better to regulate the industry instead of trying to fight against it, Zhao said. Almeida Research withdrew over $200 million from FTX.US before it filed for bankruptcy, according to analysis from blockchain firm Arkham Intelligence. In a Twitter thread, Arkham revealed that Alameda Research, FTX sister company, pulled $204 million from eight different addresses of FTX US in a variety of crypto assets, the majority of them stable coins, in the final days before the collapse. Among the withdrawn funds, $116 million or 57.1% were in stable coins pegged to the US dollar, including Tether, USD coins, Binance USD, and True USD. Arkham's analysis also showed that $49.49 million of the funds was in Ether and $38.06 million or 18.7% was in wrapped Bitcoin. The withdrawn WBTC was sent to the Alameda WBTC merchant wallet and then bridged in its entirety to the BTC blockchain, said Arkham, adding that of the $204 million transferred, $142.4 million or 69% was sent to wallets owned by FTX International, suggesting that Alameda may have been operating to bridge between the two entities. In the upcoming segment, we will let you know about the following updates. The Sandbox celebrates Korean pop culture in new mini-festival. Major Canadian crypto exchange CoinSquare's client data breached. SHIB now ranked as 15th biggest project in terms of market cap. Stay tuned for more updates.